I haven't filmed in so long. So we'll see how this goes. I guess I really don't know what Christmas is all about. It's currently November 2nd. I am not a Christmas right after Halloween kind of gal. I literally still have out like all like my pumpkin blankets. I have like all my wall art up. I have orange pillows everywhere. Like I'm just not there yet. I'm more of like a Christmas, December 1st kind of gal. But I know a lot of us or a lot of y'all are already in like the Christmas spirit, trying to get your list together and all that kind of stuff. So I'm gonna make this video and I make one of these every year and they're really fun for me because it kind of helps me with my list too. Obviously everything on this list is not on my Christmas list, but these, I feel like are some good ideas to get you started. So let's get into it because I have over a hundred. I'm looking at my computer because that's where I have them all written out at. So I do have some categories. Um, so I'll put them up on the screen because I don't know how many there are right now. So I do have some of those. If you guys like want to skip to a certain section, I'll have like everything linked pictures all like down below if you guys want to look at those of like what I have linked. So let's get into this. So my first category are clothes. So this is probably gonna be really quick and fast because you guys know everything I'm gonna say. So leggings, sweatshirts, jeans, rings. I always get questions about my rings. Um, I get them for like this little beach, beach ring shop <laughs> in the Outer Banks. Um, they do have an online website, so I'll link it below. Um, that's where I go and get all my rings. I love them so much. That's what they look like. That one's my class ring, so that's like the only one that's not from there. And this was like my grandmother's ring. But rings, gold layered necklace. So these, this one I have on right now. My friend, she had this, Sydney, and I loved it so much. I was like, where did you get that? And she's like, oh, well, they come in a pack and they're on Amazon for like $15 and they also ha come in silver. So my stepmom was like, I love your necklace. So she ordered it in gold and she also ordered it in silver. So you have options. Gold thick hoop earrings. Again, one of my staples. I found these at TJ Maxx. I think they were like $12, but again, you probably can find some on Amazon. Booties. I have literally a pair in black, white, and tan. My tan are my favorite right now, but I love those. Great staple shoe for the fall and winter. Birkenstocks. I have the like white rubber ones and I also have like the normal ones that like wrap, well, mine like wrap around your ankle, but like that like material is the normal one. A coat, sweatpants, hats, or like beanies. Sweaters, like the one I'm wearing right now. This one I think is American Eagle, but I have like a big chunky oversized sweater for fall and winter, so good. Collegiate gear, um, so anything college related, that's that stuff always ends up on my Christmas list. I think my parents are like kind of over it. They're probably like, you're not getting anywhere. So I have so much stuff. A white button down. This has honestly become my staple this year. Like I'll wear like a black like tank top and like put that over top of it and like layer it. So cute. I'm obsessed with that right now. Tank tops for layering. Love those. I literally get all of mine from like TJ Maxx and like a double pack for like six bucks. But again, Amazon is probably your best bet. Costco slippers. I bought these probably around like a month ago. Um, and they're like a dupe for the Ugg slippers. So if you don't want to pay $120 for slippers, you can get Costco ones for like $18 and they're great. A rain jacket, a crop jacket. It's like one of those like puffy, like cropped ones. Sunglasses. Again, I get all mine from TJ Maxx because I don't want to spend that much money on sunglasses. But if you want a nice pair, I feel like asking them for Christmas is a good idea. Athletic shoes, so like any like running shoe. Airy flare sweatpants. So this is kind of a sore subject for me because I found this pair of like orange ones at a Marshall's. But like, I always check the tags when I go to these places cause like obviously like some of the stuff is name brand. And so I looked at these sweatpants, I was like, oh my God, these are so cute. They're like thin, they are flared, like so cute. And they also had a blue pair, but they were like $12. So I was like, mm, I'll just get the one pair, like it's fine. I get home and I check the tag in their area, of course. I'm like, oh my God. So I was so mad that I did not get those blue ones. But if you can find them, I love these sweatpants. NFL apparel or like any pro sport, apparel if you guys are into that crocs i have a cheetah pair of crocs and a white pair of crocs and a purple like fuzzy pair of crocs love them a cross body bag or like those like you know what i'm saying like those belt bags that everyone has i don't have one but i'd probably get the amazon one over the lulu one just because again if you can't find the theme here i'm cheap <laughs> oversized jean jacket i got one of these last year and it's so nice and thick because I got the one with like Sherpa on the inside. I love that. A corduroy jacket. So I thrifted one of these like a while ago and it was like this like olive green color and I found myself wearing it so much that I ordered one in like a 
blush like pink color to wear in the spring and i love them so that is it for clothes or like apparel um next is beauty so a lot of this stuff is like what i use on a daily basis or stuff that i like want to try so the first one is a charlotte tilbury flawless filter i mean good luck finding it i guess it's probably gonna be sold out everywhere um i also have the charlotte tilbury highlight wand the charlotte tilbury contour wand and the charlotte tilbury blush again good luck I, I doubt we'll be able to find it. Rare Beauty Blush, I just bought this maybe like a month ago and I use it every single day and I mix it with the Flawless Filter. It looks so good. NYX Eyebrow Glue. I, I'm wearing all this stuff today too. Like I have the blush on, the Charlotte Tilbury Flawless Filter. So if you're interested to see what it looks like, I'm wearing it all. NYX Concealer, the, um, what is it called? It's like a serum concealer. I love that stuff. The Anastasia Beverly Hills Brow Wiz, use that every day. A lash serum, I don't use one of these, but I feel like since they're like a little bit pricier, you could ask for that for Christmas. Telescopic mascara, this is my holy grail. I love it so much. But recently I've switched mascaras to a Maybelline Falsies mascara. It's not the original one, it's their like newer one. I'll have to find a picture and put it in. So good. I actually have like mixed, I've been mixing them and like wearing both of them. Fenty lip gloss. I own like every single shade. I swear by these. The formula is so good. Ariana Grande cloud perfume. I have that sitting over there. I also am obsessed with the new Ashley Tisdale perfume. I don't know how you say her brand, like Frenchay maybe. I don't know, but her vanilla cashmere perfume. Oh my God, it smells so good. It's like warm vanilla like it just smells like fall i love it so much i haven't tried any of the other ones but i smelled them the other day at target i think there's like a lavender and like a there's a green one but i don't remember what that scent was a spray tan so or like tanning stuff i got a spray tan last week for halloween and i was obsessed it was so easy like you don't have to do it yourself you don't have to worry about like someone like getting your back um so it was really fun so if you're interested in getting spray tan maybe ask for one of those or like a gift card or something. A nails gift card or like press on nails. The Revlon blowout brush, I have this. I don't use it as much as I should because I've started using what's next and that's rollers. I'm obsessed with rollers, like the Velcro ones. I love them so much. I didn't use them today, um, even though my hair is kind of curly, but I'm obsessed with rollers right now. Claw clips, a makeup bag, like a travel bag, a beach waver. Um, I've used this because my roommate bought it because she struggles with curling her hair. Um, it's that one where you like clamp it and then you like press the button and it spins it for you. Um, so if you have a hard time curling your hair, that's probably be helpful. Shampoo and conditioner. I right now I'm using um, the Olaplex, not Olaplex, no. Um, what is it called? The Redken um, Acidic Bonding. That's what I'm using right now. The gray, the gray bottles. And I also I use a purple shampoo because clearly I'm blonde. Um, I use the Pravana ones, the purple shampoo and conditioner. I only use that like once a week though. Pimple patches, I get the, I don't know how you say this brand. It's like COSRX, like COSRX maybe, but they come with like 90 pimple patches for like 20 bucks and I love them. I get those at Ulta, I think. All right, my next category is electronics. So I have Apple Watch. Um, I have, I think the series five, I wanna say, but I think I'm gonna ask for the series seven for Christmas because I've had this one for a few years. A new phone, an iPad. I love my iPad, I stand by it. Um, I think they just came out with a new one too. A new computer. Um, I recently just got a new MacBook and I am obsessed and I love it so much. A laptop case, which I think I'm gonna ask for for Christmas because of this new computer. Um, I wanna get like one of those clear ones, which you can probably find on the Amazon. AirPods, a car thing. So this is like from Spotify. They did something like a few, I wanna say it was like over a year ago where they like would email you and like if you're interested, they like send you one. So I've seen like TikToks and videos of it and it looks pretty cool. Um, so if you use Spotify, I think that's pretty fun. An Apple TV or like a Roku or Fire Stick. I personally have an Apple TV. A Nespresso. I always talk about mine. I love it so much. I got it, I think, two years ago for Christmas. Um, and I always recommend. A Keurig. An Alexa. A monitor. I have one back here, especially when I had like my old computer. Um, it was a 13 inch, so I would always like plug it into the monitor and it was just like a lot bigger. I got mine like when we were in school during COVID, so like it was helpful, like I could be on the Zoom on my computer and then like doing the work on my monitor. Um, so I love that, even like editing videos, just having like a bigger screen is great. An air fryer, I use this a lot more than like you would think that you would, um, especially like with like any frozen food, like it's so quick or like vegetables um, to like cook those, so easy. Um, and you don't have to wait for like the oven because I feel like that takes longer. A toaster oven, I swear by a toaster oven, I always grew up with one. 
Um, and I think it's the best for like reheating pizza. Like um, I make like a lot of burritos or like wraps and I like toasting my wraps or even like a bagel. Like I think a toaster oven is so nice because you can like set your like food on the tray not like in a slice toaster. So I, I swear by a toaster oven, I love mine. I think it was like $30 from Target. A speaker, a portable charger, a mini projector. I've seen these on TikTok. I don't have one and I probably won't ask for it because I don't really need it. But I feel like it'd be helpful like if you don't like have a TV or you have like a big empty wall, I feel like that would be pretty cool. My next category, I don't really know what to call it. So it's just called random. So it's like everything else that like I didn't really have a category for. We have a migraine head wrap or like a hat. I don't really know what to call it, but I've seen it on TikTok. TikTok gives me all these ideas, but I get really bad migraines and you basically like, it's this hat that you can put in the freezer so it's nice and cold and you like put it over your head, it like goes over your eyes. I think it sounds amazing. So that's definitely on my list. Um, Cause I feel like that'd be life changing. A suitcase, I need more suitcases in my life because whenever I go home, I just use those like really big like TJ Maxx bags instead of a suitcase. Candles, an ember mug. These I think are so cool. I have actually been drinking a lot more hot coffee recently. I normally like swear by iced coffee, will never drink hot coffee. But these are so cool because they're like mugs but you can like connect it to your phone and you can like keep it at a certain temperature and I think it's the coolest thing ever. Williams Sonoma mugs, I, this is a funny story. So I bought a four pack, um, I think like, two years ago, um, one for myself and then some for my parents for Christmas is like all their gifts. And I was obsessed with it. I loved it so much. I was like washing it every day so I could use it the next day. They're like clear, they're insulated. I love them so much that I asked for them the next year. I wanted another four pack and they actually sent my, my mom's the one who ordered them. She ordered one four pack and they sent her three four packs. So I kept two and she kept one. So now I have nine of them and I love them so much. Nespresso or like coffee pods, an electric corkscrew, a bar kit. So something with like a shaker, a stir. Uh, I don't, I can't think of anything else that would be in a bar kit, but like something like that where you can make like cocktails and drinks. A Steve Madden purse. I don't know why I was so specific, but that's what I have. A Stanley cup or a hydro flask. I have so many water bottles. There's no way my parents are gonna get me another one. A set of wine glasses. A Yeti coffee mug, I swear by mine, I love it so much, like the little like 14 ounce one. A chunky blanket, an umbrella. The next three, I feel like people like never think of, um, but it's a rent payment, a car payment, or like a grocery payment or like money. Adulting, you, you find yourself needing those things. So maybe ask for those for Christmas too. Games, so any like board game, not board games, but like maybe like Cards Against Humanity, like things like that, like adult games. A planner, a wall collage, um, I don't know. I don't know which way to lean. I have part of mine up here for fall. So it's like, I, what I like to do, this is chaotic. I go on, there's a big one over here. I'll see if I can find a picture and put it in, but you go on Etsy, you look up wall collage and you find a digital download. And it's like all these pictures, I think mine had like 60 or 70 pictures in it and you download it. It's like four to $5, maybe, maybe cheaper. And then you upload it. I use CVS photo because they always have such good deals. Like if you do it online and use honey, not sponsored, I wish. If you plug it in CVS, like it normally takes off at least like 10, 15 bucks. So I think I pay like $9 to like get them all printed off and you can get them the same day. So I always do it that way. I love having them. I switch it up like for seasons. So like right now it's fall and a little bit I'll put it to Christmas, December 1st. So yeah, I love a wall collage. A book bag, a coffee mug warmer. So not like the Ember mug, but like kind of like a hot plate, I guess, where you can just like put it on your desk and just turn it on and off when you need it. A cold brew maker. And then I put Emma Chamberlain cold brew. I tried hers a few months ago and I actually really like it. It's really easy cause she does the one like you steep it, like kind of like tea bags, but it's coffee. Um, and you just put it in like a big mason jar like overnight. So good. A Spotify subscription and an Amazon Prime subscription, I think also could be good gifts. And then for my last, what is this? Last 11, I just have like some gift card ideas. So Starbucks, Chick-fil-A, Dunkin', Chipotle, TJ Maxx, Ulta, Sephora, Target, Uber or like Uber Eats, DoorDash and Amazon. So that is over a hundred ideas to put on your Christmas list. I hope it was helpful. Um, a few of these are gonna be going on my personal Christmas list. But I really enjoy making these videos every year because um, again, it's helpful to me and I hope it helps you guys too. If you guys enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up down below. 
comment below your Christmas list ideas because, you know, you can never have enough, I guess. I hope you guys are having an amazing week and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.